Well, at the moment, in parts of this uh, city of Nairobi, there's a lot of anxiety, confusion, and tension. And this comes uh, after uh, the candidate for the opposition coalition, NASA, uh, announced uh, earlier in the day that uh, the results that they're witnessing are fraudulent, uh, that every, uh, everything they're seeing there is a sham, there's been massive... Uh, interference uh, through hacking of the electoral body's uh, system. And because of that, actually, we've witnessed a few skirmishes on the uh, peripheries of the city, uh, particularly in the uh, in the slums of uh, Kibera and uh, Kariobangi. Uh, but uh, nothing really massive, nothing extremely violent. But there have been some protests uh, on the streets in some of those parts of uh, Nairobi. Talk to me from the deepest, better part of uh, the, basically really, the Kenyan heart, your Kenyan heart and soul. Are you surprised at all, for example, that Mr. Dinga is coming up with this sort of complaints, especially given the history of Kenyan elections? Of course, uh the claims for possible uh, interference in the electoral process uh, were flying around way before this election uh, took place. And again, that is in the backdrop of the previous elections where uh, Mr. Raila Odinga believes that uh, he won the elections, uh, but there was rigging. And uh, therefore, he was denied victory because of interference uh, in the electoral process. Uh, but uh, at this time, also, I think uh, there is a sense that perhaps there uh, has been a rush uh, to dismiss this election results uh, because the process has not been concluded. Uh, remember that uh, the Electoral Commission, the Independent uh, Electoral Commission, has uh, documents uh, to ensure that uh, even if there is uh, some interference in the electronic transmission of the results, which uh, the Electoral Commission says are actually at the moment only provisional, there are ways and there are documents which have been signed by all the agents at the polling stations uh, that will be brought to headquarters and everybody will have access to it, to all those forms, including the media and, of course, all the political parties involved. And they will look at those numbers, compare with what was released on the screens of the IBC. But uh, at the end of the day, the results from the so-called uh, Form 34A and B are going to be the ones that will determine who really officially is the winner of this race.